on to the next handshake. Schwartz will be the first to play. He looks down at his hand. Oh, and it's a pretty decent king-queen. Well, he's going to raise with this. 170,000. And he's going to take a break. Bill Jennings out. Ben out as well. Yep. Kate looking to pick up her first hand. Doesn't do it. Yep, she hasn't played a hand since Y2K. <laughs> now Kevin with a six deuce of diamonds. And he's going to make the call out of the big blind. So these are the two chip leaders going at it here. He will flounder around, Man. hope to get lucky against the chip leader. Here we go with the flop. It's an ace 10 4. Now Jake told us before this final table started, he considers Kevin Eister by far the toughest player at this table. And yeah, they go check, check. Now seven of clubs comes off. Jake was inside straight draw. That's about it. And ace high. Again, it goes check, check. Now the board pairs aces. So will Kevin just wave the flag? He's checked it twice in a row. Usually a bluff the third time around doesn't work much. But he's going to try it because it's the only way he can win the pot. 150,000. Kevin is very good at making people leverage their chips, and he's very good at putting pressure on short stacks. And I imagine as the two biggest stacks at the table today, he and I will probably clash quite a bit. Well, you're going to clash here, that's for sure. King High is good. Well, he does make the call with just King High. He's nodding very proud of himself for making that call against the guy he considers the toughest at the table. 